apoptosis now when i'm going to be talking about apoptosis i presume that most of you have an idea how is apoptosis going to be uh, activated or how is apoptosis going to be seen so this is a pathway of apoptosis that we have made a mention of earlier right so we are going to be having the presence of rives right so this is the pathway of apoptosis which i just want you to have an idea in the intrinsic pathway please please uh, recall this in the intrinsic pathway you are having a very important role played by mitochondria mitochondria whenever it the certain genes are activated the mitochondria is going to become leaky when it becomes leaky it is going to release cytochrome c and this cytochrome c is responsible for causing activation of apf1 apaf1 this is responsible for causing formation of a hexamer which is given the name of apoptosome this apoptosome is responsible for causing activation of a caspase which is given the name of initiator caspase number 9 as i always make a mention of this fact this is a simple trick which will help you crack a question in the intrinsic pathway you have caspase 9 when you write 9 you have intrinsic caspase 9 is involved right this caspase 9 is now going to cause activation of executional caspase and executional caspase are going to be given the name of 3 6 and 7 what are caspases caspases are enzymes which are going to be causing a breakdown of the nucleic acids as well as the proteins and that is what is going to be responsible for causing cell death so what do you understand you have a role of which organelle played over here mitochondria which is the cytochrome involved cytochrome c cytochrome c activates what apf1 what is the name of the hexamer apoptosome what is the name of the initiator caspase this is going to be caspase 9 executional caspase caspase 3 6 and 7 if i'm talking about something which is going to be given the name of extrinsic pathway extrinsic pathway means something is coming from outside so from outside what is coming over here is tnf this tnf is responsible for causing a trimerization trimerization means three receptors coming together that is responsible for causing activation of caspase 8 and 10 when you write extrinsic write it this way this will always help you crack a question all right e for 8 and x means 10 so 8 and 10 caspase 8 and 10 are what are involved in the extrinsic pathway another important fact whenever you're going to be talking about fast molecule fast ligand this fast molecule is given a second name it is called by the name of cd95 so when i want to check when i want to see which cd molecule is involved in the extrinsic pathway this is going to be cd95 right cd95 so intrinsic pathway mitochondria cytochrome c apaf1 apoptosome caspase 9 extrinsic pathway cd95 you are having tnf you are having caspase 8 and 10 finally you are having executional caspases 3 6 and 